five were told to go out and buy some oil for yourselves. Think about it. Five were told to go out and buy some oil for yourselves, and it was midnight. This was the time that Jesus lived. So midnight, no stores are open 24 hours. Where are they going to get the oil? There's no DoorDash to bring the car, to bring the oil. There's no Amazon Prime with two-hour delivery. Where are they going to get this oil? There must be more to this parable than just about finding oil for a lamp. And there is more. The five wise who had the oil to burn the lamp, that oil came from within. It wasn't something that they had to go out and buy. That's what made them wise. It was their connection to and with Jesus. That's what made them wise. They had a relationship with Jesus. And that relationship kept them going. It kept them being able to burn the light. They had the strength. They had, so to speak, they had the oil to go out and be messengers of Jesus. Now the foolish, on the other hand, they did not have their own resources. They did not have that connection with Christ. They did not have that relationship with Jesus. And so they went out elsewhere looking. They looked beyond themselves. They looked outwardly. They did not have their own resources. And so were addicted to going elsewhere for sustenance looking outward, the tendency to be self-sufficient. Do it by yourself. That was their key, and that's what made them foolish. Because they relied upon themselves and not on Christ. I think we can identify with that at times in our lives. And these five foolish, they relied on everything else but Jesus. And so to speak, they were blaming others. You didn't tell me we needed to get the oil. It's your fault that we didn't get the oil. Or manipulating others. Oh, you have oil. Let us have some of this. Let us have some. Or lying and stealing. They were living not with Christ. What they were saying is, look at me. I can make it on its, own, on its own. When we do that, when we put Christ aside and say, I can make it on my own, then we become foolish. Wisdom is when we recognize and depend upon Jesus for our strength, for our oil to burn within our lives. Is Jesus is the one who sustains us. Without Christ, without Christ, then what happens to us is that we burn out. We burn out in life without Christ. And we've heard that phrase so many times, oh, I'm burned out. Well, we might get burned out because we're not dependent upon Christ. We have nothing left to give of ourselves. Nothing left to give of ourselves for others. But to be replenished and be renourished by Christ and by our relationship with Jesus. At the beginning of Mass, the children who came forward 
turning to Christ and being a witness to us, our prayer at the statement was that we're going to help them. But also at the same time, I would say they're helping us. They're coming forward to say, I want to build my relationship with Jesus. They and their families are growing in faith, being dependent upon Jesus. And that's a gradual movement in our lives, in everyone's life, to move towards Christ. But for us today, they are a witness to us of being dependent upon Christ evermore. Jesus graces us with an inner strength, always refreshing and renewing us. And for, G- for us, Jesus is an inexhaustible river of grace which is continually being replenished. Listen to that. For us, Jesus is an inexhaustible river for grace which is continuously being replenished. That grace is always flowing. All we have to do is to choose it. For Jesus gives us what we need. Jesus, so to speak, gives us what we need to be wise, not foolish. For the difference between the wise and the foolish. The fool will burn out due to a lack of seeking a continual inner source of grace. The one who realizes and accepts and depends upon Christ, those are the wise. 